हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टू कंटिन्यू द सीरीज ऑफ शॉर्टकट्स ऑफ मल्टीप्लिकेशन टुडे इन ट्रिक थ्री वी शैल लर्न हाउ वी कैन मल्टीप्लाई नंबर्स विच आर नियर टू ए कॉमन बेस सो एज यू ऑल नो द बेस क्वांटिटीज आर दोज नंबर्स विच कंटेन जीरोज दैट इज टेन वन हंड्रेड वन थाउजेंड टेन थाउजेंड वन लैक एंड सो ऑन सो इफ द टू नंबर्स विच आर टू बी मल्टीप्लाइड are near to a common base as we can see here 94 and 98 they are very near to 100 which is the common base of these two numbers so the product of these two numbers can be found out in a matter of 2 or 3 seconds only i will demonstrate this method now the first step is to take the difference of this number from the common base 100 so 100 minus 94 gives us 6 100 minus 98 gives us 2 these two differences are to be multiplied 6 into 2 12 this will give us the one part of the answer 1 2 the other part of the answer is obtained by either subtracting 94 and 2 that is 92 or 98 and 6 that is again 92 so the other part of the answer is 92 so the final answer we obtain is 9212 it is very important to note here that the common base contains two zeros so this part of the answer will contain two digits only if the product of these two numbers contains more than num the number of zeros then the method slightly changes as can be demonstrated in the next example 87 multiplied by 89 again these two numbers are having a common base 100 again we subtract these numbers from 100 100 minus 87 gives us 13 100 minus 89 gives us 11 87 minus 11 this is the first part 76 and the second part 13 into 11 which gives us 143 now the second part contains 143 that means it is having three digits but the base 100 is having only two zeros so we can retain only 4 and 3 whereas this 1 has to be carried forward to the previous number that gives us the final answer as 7 6+1743 simultaneously we have to learn the method when the two quantities to be multiplied are more than the base quantities in these two examples the numbers were below the base quantities now these two numbers are above the base quantities so 100 minus 111 gives us negative 11 100 minus 108 gives us negative 8 now you can see the product of minus 11 and minus 8 is again positive the first part of the answer 11 into 8 is 88 two digits two zeros and when we subtract 111 and minus 8 then we ultimately add them so 111 minus minus 8 gives us 119 so the final answer is 11988 let us change the base quantity now in these three examples we had the base quantity as 100 now the base quantity becomes 1000 applying the same method again now we have to subtract these two numbers from 1000 1000 minus 993 gives us 7 1000 minus 998 gives us 2 7 into 2 is 14 but 14 contains only two digits whereas the base quantity was 1000 so we need to put 10 before 14 to make the number of digits 
here and number of zeros equal the second step remains the same 993 minus 2 is 991 or 998 minus 7 is again 991 so the final answer is 991014 final example in this series Again, the two quantities are near 1000. 1000 minus 1012 gives us minus 12. 1000 minus 1006 gives us minus 6. 12 6 is 72. So, the second part of the answer is 72. But we need to have three digits because the base quantity contains three zeros. So, we need to prefix one zero here. 1012 minus minus 6 is 1018. So the final answer is 1018072. So this completes our method of multiplying numbers which have a common base. Both the numbers can be below the common base or both the numbers can be above the common base. If the numbers are different, that is one is below the common base and other is above the common base the method changes which we shall be describing in subsequent videos so friends if you have enjoyed this video kindly share kindly subscribe so that more and more students can get benefited through these shortcuts keep learning keep enjoying